you can also use what you have discovered about vertices to draw curves. I'll show you two kinds of curves that you can use in your artworks, but there are others that you can read about in the resources for this week below. In the first part of this training video, we saw how we could construct a shape by providing a series of vertices that represent the corners of that shape. We drew a series of straight lines between pairs of vertices to create the shape. We can also draw a curve around the vertices to create a curved line. Let's look at an example. To create a curve around a series of vertices, we need to use the function curveVertex to create each vertex. But that's not all. The first and last calls to curve vertex act as control vertices, which help determine the curvature of the beginning and end of the lines from the shape. Why don't you copy this code into your gallery and play around with creating curves around vertices? Another way of creating a curve, which I personally find easier to use, is to create what is known as a Bezier curve, where you identify two vertices that represent the start and end vertices for your curve, and then a control vertice that represents the curvature. Let's have a look at an example. What we do here is we start with a vertice that will be the starting point for our curve. We then call the Bezier vertex function, providing it firstly with the coordinates of our first control vertice, then the coordinates for our second control vertice, and then finally the coordinates of our endpoint for our curve. Let's show this again, but highlighting each of these. First, the start and end vertices. And again, with our control points shown in red. Let's have a look at a more complex example now. We have seen how we can draw one Bezier curve, but what if we wanted to draw multiple continuous curves? We can do that within the same process, by just including multiple calls to the Bezier vertex function. Each subsequent call will connect in the last vertice in the previous call to the first vertice in the next call, like so.